Itakun, the ball. The one who handed me the soccer ball was the most beautiful girl in school and our club's idol, Shirogiku Fumiki-san. She's one year older than I, Tomoku Yeda, and she became a sophomore a few days ago. Thank you. <laughs> Good luck with practice. Yes! I'm a substitute, but I'm practicing hard every day. I want to become a starter one day and be recognized by Fumiki-san. If anything, I wanted to go out with her. But... Wait, where's Fumiki-san today? Oh, I heard she's off today, as usual. I see. Fumiki-san sometimes misses club activities like this. Rumor has it that she might be on a date with her boyfriend. She's so cute that it would be no surprise if she did have a boyfriend. But there's no proof. So, I was thinking of confessing my feelings to her someday. One day? Hey, you know what? Miu, who's in the next class, told me that she talked to the Love Counseling Club and got to go out with Inamori in the A class. What? No way! Inamori, the handsome ace in the basketball team? That's right! Isn't that amazing? That's amazing! Isn't the Love Counseling Club on the third classroom on the third floor of the third school building? And when you write your name in classroom and put it in the box, you hear from them later, right? What kind of creepy story is that? Does something like that really exist? Yeah, it's popular so it's hard to get in touch with them, but when they do, they give you relationship advice. And there's a high probability of getting into a relationship! Uh... <laughs> that's too good to be true. If I could date someone so easily like that, I wouldn't have any trouble at all. That's what I thought. The third classroom is here, right? I visited the third floor of the third school building during lunch break. Okay, no one saw me. I'm clutching straws here. I figured if there was any hope at all, I should cling to it. Is this... Is it really okay to just leave it like this? Despite it being an empty classroom? I entered the classroom because it was unlocked and found a box on the podium that said, Address to the Love Counseling Club. And I unintentionally chuckled. Let's just put this in before anyone sees me. I put the paper in the box and quickly left the classroom. And then... Huh? Wait! Itakun? What? Fumiki-san! What are you doing here? That goes to you too. Did you have something to do in this classroom? N no My friends actually tricked me. I was told I would see something good in here, but all I saw was a strange box. <laughs> huh? Really? Yes! What about you, Senpai? What? What other reason would there be? Students wouldn't come to a place like this because they have no reason to be here. And yet, Fumuki-san came here, which means she's here for relationship advice. Damn, Fumuki-san likes someone. Could it be the captain? That handsome captain? No, it could also be the genius game maker, Hachisen who's the ace of the team in his sophomore year. He's really handsome, so he gets asked out by girls from other schools. Um, bye, Itakun. Oh, Fumuki-san. There's not much time left for lunch, so get back to class. She laughed after saying that. I thought you had something to do in this classroom. I was returning to the classroom with that question in mind. The next day. Wait! A letter? From who? I opened the shoebox and found a letter inside. Could it be a love letter? What's the sender's name? Nothing. Who could it be from? So I opened the letter. Please come to the fourth classroom on the fourth floor of the fourth school building at lunchtime today. Is this from the Love Counseling Club? 
Why are they arranging such ominous numbers? It's kind of scary. While I'm happy to hear back from them, I'm second-guessing my decision to go because of the ominous numbers lined up. But... I can't let this chance pass me by! Who cares about such ominous numbers if I could get into a relationship? You're a man. Just go for it. That's what I thought. Lunch break. I visited the fourth classroom on the fourth floor of the fourth school building. What's with this dark classroom? How spooky. They even changed the curtains in the classroom. Am I in the occult research club instead of the love counseling club? Class and name, please. Whoa! You scared me. I thought you were just a statue. Class and name, please. Oh, yes. I'm Tomoki Eda. Second year. Class D. Then, please have a seat. Despite looking so shady, this person was very polite. It's hard to tell through the mask, but is this voice female? Who in the world would dress so suspiciously? First of all, you are not allowed to disclose any information about the Love Counseling Club. How come? There are a lot of people who want to talk to us. If people find out who we are, they will come to us, which that will hinder our activities. I see. That's tough. What happens if I break it? <laughs> I'm sure something will happen that will make you regret it. What? We begin by gathering a lot of information, including a background check on our client. We find out what kind of student he or she is, who he or she is interested in, and if he or she has any bad behavior. Doing so, we usually get one or two embarrassing pieces of information. Isn't this an awful thing to be doing? We have no choice. We are trying to make relationships work. But I just submitted the request yesterday. How can you gather my information so quickly? I have no need to look into yours. What? <laughs> uh, no nothing. Would you like me to tell you about your information and who you like if you don't believe me? Um, yes. You graduated from Yuki Junior High School, which is a famous school for their strong soccer team. In your first year of high school, you were a promising striker. However, in the summer of your freshman year, you missed a shot with a decisive chance to tie the game and added time to the semi-finals of the prefectural tournament in which you were a starter. The game went to penalty kicks, but you missed again and the team lost. You lost confidence and fell into a slump. Although you were one of the best players on the team during practice, you became a substitute since you couldn't get results in the crucial games. Am I correct? You know too much! How do you know so much? Yes. And the person you like... Uh, uh, uh. What? Why are you shutting up? Do, do you do you really want to hear? What do you mean? I, I, I mean, isn't it embarrassing to be told who you like? Why are they getting so flustered all of a sudden? Well, yes. Uh, right. But I'm going to confide in you anyway. Uh, hmm. Ah, uh, I see. So... That's how it is. What? What is? You don't really know who I like, do you? That's why you're trying to play it off, right? N no, p please don't take me for a fool. But you can't tell me? Uh, I, I can tell you! F f <coughs> Fushiku, right? Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't catch what you said. It's Fumaki Shirakiku, right? Uh, that's right. So, you really know. S see? I I'm embarrassed. Th that's why I didn't want to tell you. So, what are you concerned with? Uh, I actually... I want to go out with Fumuki-san. <laughs> Wait.
Wait, what's wrong? Are you okay? <laughs> it's your fault. I didn't do anything. <laughs> it's nothing. Please just ask her out. Then everything will work out. That's it? Um, what happened to the love counseling? Ah, uh, no, no, no need. Just, just go ahead and ask her out right now. That's impossible! She's the most popular and beautiful girl in the school! Uh. She's like an idol for our club! She's so cute! Uh. If I ask her out and get rejected right away... Wait, what happened? <laughs> because you're being relentless! Um, are you sure you're okay? You should get checked out. I am in the worst rage of my life right now! And how come? Then, when will you ask her out? Um, when I become someone she can recognize? No, you aren't being specific enough. If you keep talking like that, then you will never ask her out! What? Please set a more concrete goal! But then, if I win the high school championship? Hitakun, you have no intentions of asking her out, do you? It may not be impossible, but that's too unrealistic! But I have to become this much of a man! You're putting them on a pedestal! I think it would be enough if you could just become a starter! I guess she didn't like what I said so much that she stopped using honorifics. I mean, she's coming on way too strong. But she's a really attractive person, so... I don't want to set my sights so low. I'm afraid that even if I ask her out, she won't be interested in me. Oh, you're such a pain! Just ask her out! I told you. I can't do that. All right. I'll take the middle ground and do it after I become a starter and win the prefectural tournament. Are you really going to ask her out if you win the prefectural tournament? Yes, of course. If you don't, I'll tell everyone about your embarrassing secret. Wait, what secret are you talking about? That time during training camp when you went to the warehouse to get some sports drink powder for the manager and spilled it all over your head. What? Only fubuki san and the coach know about that! I can't believe you know about that! But that must mean the coach told! The kind fubuki san would never go around telling people! <laughs> uh, anyway, you must become a regular and participate in the prefectural tournament as soon as possible! And win, so you can confess your feelings for her! Okay, I'll do my best. After that, I thanked her and returned to the classroom. After school. Tomoki-kun? Yes, uh, what is it? Wait, Tomoki-kun? Yeah. I was thinking of calling you that starting today. Is that okay? I... Uh, I don't mind. I... I'm so happy to have Fumuki-san call me by my first name! Ah, you can call me Shiragiku, too. Uh, well then, Shiragiku-san? Yeah? Why are we getting so close to each other all of a sudden? Did someone from the Love Counseling Club do something? Speaking of which... Tomoki-kun will be on a different training menu from today. What? Why all of a sudden? Mm, I talked about it with the coaches, and you're known for your technique, right? You just haven't been able to put it to apply that, so I thought it would be better to let the experience of success soak into your body instead of just regular practice. So, until the friendly game this weekend, you're going to practice scoring goals after getting past the defender. Isn't that too sudden? We don't have much time before the regional tournament, and Tomoki's return is essential if we want to go to the high school championships. That's why the coaches agreed to this practice. Was this practice your idea, Shirogigo-san? I just think it would be a shame for Tomoki kun not to make a comeback. I just told them it would be better for you to practice overcoming the trauma. Then the coaches agreed and came up with this practice. Uh, are you serious? It's okay. To be honest, we can't win the prefecture with our captain as our only striker. 
We need you to break down the tight defense of Tendo Gakuen, the defending perfectual champions. Hachizen! Please, Tomoki-kun, put your trust in us so we can win. And then, let's win the perfectual tournaments. Sh shitakiku san Okay? I'll give it a try! Ah! Thank you, Tomoki-kun! And so I decided to do the special practice. We didn't have much time before the friendly game, but I'll do my best. Although, my teammates were frustrated since shitakiku san was holding my hand. The days that followed. Go for it, Tomoki-kun! I continued practicing shooting past defenders, cheered on by Shirigiku-san. From the end of the warm-up at the start of practice, all the way to the cool-down before the end of practice. And then... Ada, Run! I was given a starting spot in the friendly game over the weekend, which created a decisive opportunity for me. My future was on the line, whether I make or break it here. Tomoki-kun, remember the practice and give it your all! Er, I'm gonna score! I receive a tough pass and face the opposing defender as Shirigiku-san cheers me on. This is a situation I've been practicing for the past few days. I intentionally look at the captain, which causes the defender to look at the captain in anticipation of a pass. In that moment, I dribble in. Yes, I'm through! Not so fast! I'm not gonna let you shoot! I'm not gonna lose! I shot while colliding with the defender. And the ball goes past the goalie's hands and into the net. Yes! Yes! Tomoki comes back! shitagiku san was very happy when I scored. To be honest, my heart was pounding when I saw that. We ended up winning the friendly game, 3-1, to one, with me scoring two goals in the second half. After scoring a hat trick, I was recognized by everyone and became a starter. After that, we won the district tournament and went on to win the prefectural tournament. There were some close games, and the final was tied until additional time. And then, oddly enough, I had the same decisive chance from when I was a freshman. But unlike a year ago, I was able to score this time. That's how we won the championship. Congratulations on the win. That was an amazing performance. Shirigiku-san, no, it's all thanks to you. That's not true. It's all thanks to your hard work, Tomoki-kun. I was able to overcome my slump thanks to Shirigiku-san's help in talking to the coaches. Thank you so much. I don't need to be thanked. Uh, rather than that, don't you have anything else to say? Oh. Yes, there is. To be honest, I think we should probably talk about this somewhere else. Let me say it now so I won't be embarrassed. Of course. I've been waiting for this day for a long time. Maybe she got the message from the Love Counseling Club. I wondered that based on Shirigiko's reaction, but she didn't seem to mind, so I decided to continue. I like you for your cheerfulness and smile, Shirigiko-san. Please, go out with me. Uh, yes, of course. I like you too, Tomoki-kun. Really? Yeah, I've liked you since you were a freshman. Because you looked so happy and cool playing soccer. That's why it was so hard for me to see you in pain after you hit your slump. I'm so glad to see you back on the pitch like this. Shirigiko-san! Thanks for asking me out. I've been dreaming of this day, so I'm really happy. <laughs> it's like you knew I was going to ask you out. I did. Since I'm the one you asked for relationship advice. Oh, really? Wait, what? shirigiko san you were in the love counseling club? That club has been passed down from generation to generation. The older students approach the girl who seems promising. So I've been in the club since the second half of my sophomore year. Th that's a shocking fact. I was surprised when you came too. And you were so smitten with me. I'm so embarrassed. I want to dig myself a hole. <laughs> too bad. I won't let you run. Since you were so smitten, 
You'd better take care of me, okay? <laughs> uh, yes, of course. I'm looking forward to it, Shirigiku-san. <laughs> yeah, me too, Tomaki-kun. That's how we came to be together. But... You guys stop asking each other out and flirting in a place like this just because you won. Get to cleaning up! The coach got really mad. But to be honest, I didn't care about the fact that the coach was angry, since I was so happy. <laughs>